at golfcoastairshows.com. Thank you for tuning in. Today I'm going to teach you a little bit on like how to install AI aircraft to, uh, you know, of course, to um, FSX. Apparently you're doing it with uh, World of AI. What you want to type in up here in the search bar is world dash of AI of dash AI dot com. Now I already got it typed in there so I can just click enter and it will show up on this page. What you first want to do to install AI aircraft is select the installer and you can install it from right on this page right here. Um, so you click on that and then once you have installed the installer of course uh, you can go to airports. Uh, for example, the airport near my house is KVPS, which is Northwest Florida Regional Airport. And you know, it's not a very busy airport because uh, uh, it's part of an Air Force base. And see, you got these different airline packages down here. And you will select Delta Connection. Or you can find uh, Delta Airlines that sits right here and you click on that you download it and unfortunately I've already downloaded that sorry that and sorry about that I tried to hit the start button and not the desktop okay <coughs> ignore this that doesn't mean anything you see I got version 3 Delta Airlines what you wanna do is uh, just click this one and click extract all and I have a folder set up in my documents um, where it is set up right here on World of AI. You click OK, click Extract. And as you can see, it's loading. And once the extraction folder opens, you can close downloads, which I'm about to do right this very second. You can close that down. And now what you want to do is open. Uh, oh yeah, I just want to make a quick note. This installer right here, if you try to run the installer when it's still in the zip file, don't do that. You'll get like an error. If you have problems with this error, uh, just go to the World of AI's forum. You can go to the Frequently Asked Questions on this page, uh, which will probably be down here somewhere, but I'm not signed in right now. And, it'll, and the question is at the very bottom of the page. You can find it, and uh, it will tell you um, why you're getting the errors. So what you want to do now is open the WOAI installer, click allow. As you can see it's version 2.04 and click next and you'll show up at this uh, little form page. Uh, if you have Microsoft Flight Simulator X, you want to go down here and click on that, or FS2004, click on this. I have FSX, we're going to click on this right here. And do not check this box, it, ma it makes it a lot e easier on yourself if you don't. Now what you want to do is click on Delta Airlines WOAI, I have it right here. Click Open, click Next, I agree, and click Next and you just wait for this to load and just give it a few minutes or a few seconds and it will analyze and scan the file and will uh, bring out the details in which is in the file and will install it to your FSX simulator currently loading okay now we have the package <coughs> all scanned up and it is ready to be installed just click this click install and it said Northwest Airlines should be removed when installing this package. Okay, I don't have Northwest Airlines version 2 because I just want to make it accurate. Northwest Airlines merged with Delta if you did, if you guys did not know that. So, we're going to go ahead. We've clicked install and we are awaiting the arrival.
wants to do this shit should take long. Anyway, you click install and it'll uh, come up to a page and it'll say exit. And the reason I'm finishing early is because, like, um, I'm recording this on it. Okay, here's the installation package. Click exit, and now it will exit your page, and you will be ready to fly the world of AI. So that's how you do that. And just open your flight simulator. All right, guys, uh, this is the end of this video. Um, please go check out and click subscribe on one of my videos that you see. Um, so, yeah, see you guys later.